Facebook Arts from India pays taxes in America. Infosys Arts from America pays taxes in India. YouTube, Apple, other tech companies earn from the whole world and pay taxes almost nowhere. Travel influencers come to our country, make videos of our country, earn from that video and then pay income taxes nowhere. The government will tolerate anything but they will not tolerate messing with their taxes. And that is why OECD, Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development, with the help of G20, built a solution to this which is known as Amount A. What's interesting is this is applicable only to the largest multinational enterprises. How? Because it is applicable only to companies who have crossed the turnover of 20 million pounds. Which means that it will be applicable to only few hundreds of the companies. Because these few companies are the real reason. What they do is when they transfer the profits from one country from the country of origin to their home country, they find an island in between to eat up those profits. Paying sugar tax. So what will happen is the multinational enterprise needs to pay taxes from the market that it is generating the income from rather than the country where it is registered. Which means that if Google or YouTube or Facebook or Instagram is earning from the land of India, they need to pay taxes to the Indian government. Can you tell me which country in the world will collect the most amount of taxes if this new rule amount A becomes applicable?